everybody and warm regards to everyone. Uh, before I start my speech, I would like to request our OCU to please provide me uh, two more minutes. Okay, thank you so much. Let me go ahead and post this. Uh, at Smart Club, about to give a killer speech and next up, um, I have a meeting with really amazing entrepreneurs. Hashtag Berry's Apparel Brand. Hashtag Living the Life of the Dreams and hashtag winning. And how can I forget this? Sophie? <laughs> All right. OK, so my life is really interesting. I wake up at 5 AM in the morning with a bright smile on my face. And that's without an alarm clock. You know why? Because my passion wakes me up. And after a, an hour of yoga and meditation, I hop into a cold shower and I visualize my dreams. That's like before any of you have even like gone through a first social media feed, a feed, right? So I can say that I have this freedom of choosing what you guys cannot. Unlike you, I can go on a train, uh, trekking when I want, whenever I want, and how for how long I want to. So what I'm just saying here is I'm an entrepreneur and like, like I, I just like don't need to tell all of you this because most of you guys already follow me on Instagram, right? So uh, my life is really, really interesting. So it's kind of a funny thing to say this because it almost sounds uh, truth. And it's very easy to put up this brave face and then to keep up this appearance and then uh, pretend like you are successful. But in actual, you have no clue what you're really doing with your life. I actually quit my job two years ago. I used to work there as a digital marketing officer. And I quit thinking my job because like there are a lot of dreams of mine and in hopes that in hopes and dreams that I would fulfill them. Because being your own boss, you have a lot of flexibility, you have a lot of time, and success is bottomless. But that is not the case. There is this study that says that is linked with entrepreneurship and the mental health issues. What it says is entrepreneurs, one entrepreneur out of every three entrepreneur suffers or experiences depression. When I have friends or my family, they ask me how everything is going. I smile, I grind my teeth and then I say, everything is going well, everything is going great. But what I really wanted to say to them is, this, this has been like the very toughest journey of my life. This is really, really struggling. I'm like struggling a lot. But I'm guilty of keeping up this face, this mask on my face, and then guilty of feeling to this myth of being an entrepreneur and living the life of an entrepreneur. And then, and, and then like, a, and, and then showing it like, you know, it is something that we all should pursue. So I sometimes, I sometimes like ponder upon this thing, like why so many of the people, they are attracted towards being an entrepreneur and start their own business. And in my opinion, what I think is, this is because of these superstar entrepreneurs like Steve Jobs, like Elon Musk, like uh, Richard Branson. Social media and front cover piece of magazines, they have labeled these entrepreneurs in such a way that it looks so cool, it looks so sexy, you know? And then, th th this is like making people feel like, okay, it is something amazing. But in reality, that is not the case. Being an entrepreneur, chasing your, ch ch chasing for a fortune and like chasing for this uh, richness, is that all to it for being an entrepreneur? It is deeper than that. There is, there is this, there is this example I'd like to give you. Mars One, there is, there is this uh, Dutch company, very, very, very controversial company. They have announced that in 2020, in 2013, they have announced that they have a mission of taking humankind to the Mars by 2030 gradually, and they want to settle humankind over there very gradually. And the catch is, like, when you go there, it's a one-way trip the possibility of coming back home is very, very rare. And it is also labeled as one of the most dangerous journey of humankind. But 
most of the people they have registered like the the, the number is insane total number of 200,000 people they have registered uh, to be on that journey that's insane right so the reason why so many of the people they would like to go to Mars leaving everything behind in the planet Earth just like go on a mission is the reason why so many of the people they believe they want to be an entrepreneur they want to be in this journey is same that is the quest to be to find a quest like uh, for, for the purpose the sense of purpose to find the sense of purpose that is the reason why so many people are doing that and psychology in there's a study in psychology what what it states is if a person does not have a sense of purpose what happens is he is more vulnerable or she is more vulnerable towards uh, boredom frustration depression and other different kinds of negative uh, impacts on his or her life right so it is that much of a pressure to a person that it gives if you will not find a sense of uh, freedom so most of the people they believe that because of this dearest quest of their life they go into entrepreneurship and then they feel like okay being being an entrepreneur they are gonna get so much of adventure they get onto a journey they they get to find the meaning of life but like that might not be the case or that can be the case for me it has been the case right like what happened is like being an entrepreneur it has been the toughest journey of my life and it has also been one of the most rewarding journey of my life as well it has taught me a lot of things but what I'm just saying is like when someone says and comes that they want they says that they want to be an entrepreneur what they really are saying is they are trying to find a quest for themselves and you must be thinking how you can go ahead and like start finding your own quest right so I suggest you guys to like go ahead and like find out what you're really really curious about just follow what you're really really interested about and then no matter no matter what like your journey or like your quest should not directly be related with entrepreneur it, should, it, it can be related or it cannot be related with entrepreneur but like, I urge you to go ahead and like start your journey from today because no matter how small your quest is, quest is it's definitely gonna change bring change in the world for all of us so thank you so much